Shalom. Welcome to Daily Blessing. Today, you're going to be blessed. You know what the Word of God says? Daily Blessing. The day is yours and yours also the night. You established the sun and the moon. It was you who set all the boundaries of the earth. You made both summer and winter. Psalm 74 verse 16 and 17. You know, friends, the Lord is the Creator. He created everything. Everything is there for you. He wants to bless you. He wants to use you. He wants to minister to you. And at the same time, as you are blessed, share your testimony to others that they too may be blessed, that they may know the Lord Jesus Christ. I would love you to read some um, 1 Samuel chapter 21 to 24 to encourage you to build your faith up and to move on in life. You know, the answered prayers, the Bible speaks about truth and the way the Lord will answer you. And it shall come to pass that before they call, I will answer. And while they are yet speaking, I will hear. Can you imagine the Lord will answer while you are speaking? You are bringing your requests to God that you know that the breakthrough, the victory is in your hands. That you know, God is able to move the mountain for us, and it shall be given you. Seek, and ye shall find. Knock, and it shall be open unto you for everyone that us receive. And he that seeks, find. And to him that knock, it shall be open. Friends, God is there for you. Today, let us join our hands. Let us put our hands together. Let us pray. Let's believe God that the supernatural will come to you. The anointing will come to you. The breakthrough will come to you. That miracle will come to you. Your hands are blessed. Your children are brilliant because the Lord has ordained you, has anointed you. So let us pray today. Father, I speak blessing over their lives, over their situation, over their condition, even that sickness. In the name of Jesus, they shall flee. In the name of Jesus, they shall be healed. In the name of Jesus, by your stripes, they are healed. And Lord, we thank you for the victory that you're giving them. Thank you, Father God, that they will have the testimony. They will have the victory. They will know that you are there for them. And Lord, you care and you love them. And so, Father, I just thank you for the covering, the protection over their family, their children, their businesses will flourish, oh God. Where their legs tread, they shall flourish. Where their hands touch the things, they shall be blessed. Father, I thank you for your goodness and your mercy. I bless you. I bless you. I will lead the blind by the way they have not known. A long, unfamiliar path, I will guide them. I will turn darkness into light before them and make the rough places smooth. These are things I will do. I will not forsake them. This is what the word of the Lord says. He will not forsake you. He will not forsake you. Remember, He will guide you through. Even though you are blind, He will guide you. The rough places, He will make it smooth. Remember that. Because in the times that you are going through, the valleys that you are going through, He will make it smooth for you again. And you will have the victory. Friends, do write to me. Do send me your comments.